My name is Brent Stabener and I'm a consultant with Logan Consulting. In today's video, I will be showing you how to best utilize revenue and expense deferral in Microsoft GP. The revenue and expense deferrals module for Microsoft Dynamics GP simplifies deferring revenues or distributing expenses by enabling users to make entries for future periods within the GL, receivables management, payables management, sales order processing, purchase order processing, and invoicing modules. To set this tool up, navigate to the Microsoft Dynamics GP menu, Tools, Setup, Financial, Deferral. When deferring in the Sales and Purchasing series, right here, there are two methods of doing this, the Balance Sheet method and the Profit and Loss method. If you use the Balance Sheet Posting method, there will be two accounts involved in the deferral. The deferral account, such as deferred revenue or expense, and the recognition account, such as recognized revenue or expense. As you can see, when you navigate to deferral profiles, and let's pull this up, you will see two different accounts, the recognition account and the deferral account. The second method is the profit and loss method. There are five accounts rather than two that are involved in this process. To note, some of the five accounts can be the same. Now let's change our settings to profit and loss. And now let's navigate back to deferral. Excuse me, deferral profiles. And let's make another one. And when we go to receivables management, you'll see five accounts. These five accounts are the original posting of the revenue or expense, account for when the deferral is applied. This can be the same as number one. A balance sheet account for the deferred amount. A balance sheet account for when the deferral is recognized. That can be the same as number three. And finally, a PL account for when the deferral is recognized. Now you are ready to create your own deferrals. For more information, please visit our website at www.loganconsulting.com or contact us via email at info at or via phone at 312 345 8800.